they be doing? Yes? Yes? Are you hungry? Is it time to feed you? Yes, I think it's time. Mm -hmm. No wonder I still wanted me. I'm gorgeous. Snowball, honey, come on. No ball, come on. Darling! Oh, what's this? I'm, uh, I'm gonna go make some music with my friends. Have you seen Frank lately? His ass is getting humongous. You can play peanut butter on it. Anyway, how are you doing? I'm doing okay, I guess. I'm doing just splendid. This morning I was waked by Snowball, and I knew it was time to start my day. My baby was hungry, and he always gets hungry around 9.30. But first, and always first, I started my day with a thousand chin-ups. Like this. Come on, join me. Oh, what is wonders for this part? Just the other day, a man at Johnny Rocket said I could look 45. 45, can you believe that? Oh, uh, no, that's, that's pretty flattering. Not bad for a 70-year-old man. You tell my uh, 500 sit-ups every morning is doing wonders, it's working. Come on, feel it. Feel my muscle. Uh, Come on, feel, feel it. Wow, that's, uh, that's 500, pretty impressive. 500 sit-ups every morning. That's why I keep my boys figure. Anyway, how's your mother doing? She's, she's doing all right. She's got a lot of work in this college. Stuff. It's really great. I hardly ever see her. Is she mad at me? You know, she still owes me for the elephant I got her. The green one? Does she have the money that she owes me? No, you don't. That's well, anyway, you know who else owes me money? Well, they don't really owe me money, but I think they should still pay me money, because I'm so great for them. Colin Frank, you know who they are, Colin Frank? No. They have this humongous place on Wilson. Anyway, your mother doesn't really like them. I think she's jealous because they're wealthy. I know, I'm, I am a little bit jealous, too. Anyway, what was I talking about? Oh, oh, yeah. Well, I gave them this lavish Christmas gift, and I think the least they could do, you know, is give me a couple hundred dollars next time I see them. I need to pay rent, and I need to pay for this new sweater. You know, just if you like, I get it all. Anyways, it was six hundred dollars at Brooks Brothers. And there was a guy who sold it to me said it was originally nine fifty, but he insisted on giving me a deal. I think he must have been gay and must have been interested in me because, well, with a deal like that, it's unheard of. That's, uh, that's a pretty remarkable deal. Where'd you get the jacket? Did you notice anything else other than the jacket that I love? You know, but, you know, I, I got this fancy watch because go I got all dolled up. I'm going to see Richard. You know Richard? Oh, yeah. You do? I'm going to see him for lunch. Would you prove my choice of jewelry? <laughs> Ethel, this is Ethel's. She gave it to me. I don't know how much it costs, but it looks very expensive. Oh, well, look at the time. I gotta be going. I don't want to keep the ship waiting. Bye-bye. Oh, hey Scott. Oh, how are you doing? Well, I'm, I'm doing all right. I'm having a pretty good day. Um, what's that you say? Lunch in the movie? Oh, um, that'd be splendid. I'm, I'm totally free. 
Yeah, you can, you can come get me in about five minutes. Um, I'll be waiting in the back alley. All right. Oh, thank you. All right. I'll, I'll see when you get here. I think I can make it. Yeah, to lunch. <clears throat> I think I came down with something bad. I'm not feeling too well. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go see the doctor. Yeah, you, you can call me back tomorrow. Yeah, thank you. <clears throat> yeah, maybe yeah we can reschedule some other time. Sorry. 